Hello everyone, this is Gary Tonnenkoff from more than a snapshot.com. Today I saw the coolest story on Petapixel about a plugin for Lightroom that allows you to publish directly to Instagram. Now, you may know that Instagram typically doesn't let you put any images on Instagram through the computer itself. You have to go through a mobile phone. I always thought that was kind of a pain, so I never added a ton of photos to Instagram, but now we can go directly from Lightroom and publish to Instagram. So, if you want to try this out, just go to lrinstagram.com and you can check out all the features and how it works. But uh, simply go to download. It is free, but of course, if you like it, they would like you to register it for $10. Click download and it will download it right down here to your control bar. Then you simply, um, I like to click show in folder and then right click on the folder and extract extract all extract it to a folder where you're going to remember I sent it to a documents uh, my documents folder and I created a special plugin folder to put it in once you've extracted it all you have to do is go to um, Lightroom and go down go to the library module go to publish services and then you can go to edit settings and where you really need to go is the plugin manager and then when you get to the plugin manager you have to click add and then go and find the folder that says lr instagram dot lr p l u g i n so then click on that and select that folder after you do that it'll add that plugin lr instagram as uh, one of your plugins for lightroom and then say done and it'll ask you to configure it when you click on the plugin first of all you'll have to log in with your username and password here you can choose what kind of setup you want to have when you post an image do you want it to be a caption and a hashtag or just a hashtag or just a caption or a title or whatever you want it to be do you want it to sharpen it and you can even have it add a watermark so let me see I'll choose um, I'll choose a watermark and see how that works. I haven't tried that yet. Okay, and then I'll click Save. Okay, so to then publish a photo, all you have to do is find it in Publish Services and then just drag your photo over this little uh, Instagram Photos thing right here. Click on that. And then if you click the Tiles um, thing, the Grid View, you will see that there's a publish button up at the top and you'll see the photo that you want to publish so if I click on that photo and then look on the right side where the metadata is if I want it to have metadata that's going to be published with the photo I need to type in a caption that would be a description of the scene so I'll just put tulips on the farm and then if I scroll down uh, way at the bottom the Instagram app has some things here and of course the hashtag is um, probably the more important one so I'll put in a few hashtags okay once you filled in the hashtags you just hit publish and you'll see that it's going to process that and change the size of it it should add a watermark to it and publish it now, I don't have any way of showing you my phone, um, but at the moment I don't. Um, I'm just checking to make sure. Yes, it's been published. And if you want to see it, you can go to my Instagram account at more underscore than underscore a underscore snapshot. And uh, you can see that photo. It works great. It's very simple to use. And if you want to add a lot of your photos easily from your computer to Instagram, this is uh, so far the best way I've seen. If you've seen anything better, let us know in the comments. Again, thanks. This has been Gary D. Tonincourt from more than a snapshot.com.